this is what it would look like up and then down the rod swinging here. Well, as the piston is approaching top dead center, it's wrote, the rod is rotating. Yep. And then you don't want to, if, if you just took the piston and rod and had it at top dead, top dead center, TDC is the That guy. was peak pressure. Peak pressure. And if it just, just if it stayed here, you would have a pressurized increase that yep. will go from on a piston of this size, this is about 10 inches of surface area. Yep. Well, a combustion process might meet and exceed 3,000 PSI. Times 3,000 pounds inches. per square inches times 10 inches, that's 30,000 pounds of actual force. Yep. Now, it just sitting here static, that's gonna break or bend something, which yep. happens, which is when guys lift heads, they bend connecting rod, you see the connecting rod all squiggled and stuff. Uh, it'll get bearings, your bearing contact point is two circles, two concentric circles that when you increase the pressure, they go from being concentric to you coincident, mean which means they intersected a line. Coincident, good word. Right? Yeah, that's good work. Uh, they, it aligned, two dimensional line, yep. which is 10,000 pounds of force on one line, which flattened bearings really quick. Mm -hmm. So you want to have the piston moving up and start the burn early because the burn, it's a burn, it takes time. Yep. And, and then you this want piston's piston moving really fucking up. fast at that point. Yeah. 